Oh, hey Clear Lake, how's it going out there? I'm just checking out some of the happenings going on this weekend. There's a lot of cool stuff. Check this out. There's some festivals going on, and the first one I have on my list is called Keels and Wheels, and it's going to feature classic cars and boats that will be on display May 1st and May 2nd, and it's one of Clear Lake's most popular events of the year. And this year's show features Alfa Romeo and a rare collection of special body Packards. Cool. That'll be good for all you car lovers out there. And it'll be Saturday from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. and then Sunday from 9 a.m. until after the 4 p.m. departure of the parade. Ooh, parade, too. That sounds like fun. Uh, tickets are $30 to purchase in advance and then $35 at the gate. For more information, go to www.keels, that's K-E-E-L-S-wheels.com. Oh, what else do I have on my list here? Ah, the Bluegrass Music Festival going on Friday through Sunday. Cool. It says it starts Friday at the Kima Visitor Center parking lot at 03 Bradford Street from 7 to 10 p.m. and then Saturday from noon to 10 p.m. and Sunday from 5 to 8 p.m. And the best part, it's free. Go Kima. I love free. All right, we have the League City Texas Music Festival also going on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and that's going to be at the Walter Hall Park in League City. And 10 to 15 bands will be on display this weekend, and we'll post a band lineup on our site, so just check out the event section below. Now, then we have two other events happening that revolve around food. Love it! We've got the Gumbo Cook-Off. It's an all-day Gumbo Cook-Off on Saturday on Harris Street behind the Kima Visitor Center. Kima's really bumping this weekend, so go check that out. And then the Johnson Space Center is also having a cook-off, but they're having a chili cook-off. And it's all on Saturday from 11 to 5 p.m., and tickets are $10 at the gate, and that covers all the beer that you can have because they've got a bunch of kegs and a bunch of chili, and you can definitely have a good time, so go check that out. The arts this weekend going around Clear Lake. We have Clear Lake Symphony presents the season's finale tonight. So that's April 30th. Yeah. Don Yanni variations on a nursery rhyme and Beethoven Symphony 3. That sounds cool. And the concert series starts at 7 30 p.m. tonight, Friday, April 30th. And it's at the Gloria Day Lutheran Church in Nassau Bay. So you can get more information at www.clearlakesymphony.org. And tickets are $10 for, $10 for adults, $8 for seniors, and $7 for students. And they are available at the door also in advance. So just go to that www.clearlakesymphony.org to get your tickets if you're interested. The next thing on my list is the Bay Area Chorus, which is also performing at the Gloria Day Lutheran Church in Nassau Bay. They will be performing Voices of Poets and Playwrights. The Bay Area Chorus will share the stage on May 2nd with the Prairie View a and Chamber Singers. The concert starts at 4 p.m. and that's at the Gloria Day Lutheran Church in Nassau Bay. Don't forget. And tickets for all performances are $10 in advance and then tickets are $15 for adults and $12 for students at the door. Let's see what else do I have here. Ah, the band Madigan is playing tonight at Hugh and Jeff's. Oh, I'm sorry, not tonight, but Saturday, May 1st. They're going to be playing at Hugh and Jeff's. And if you've never checked out Madigan, you really should. They're a really great band to listen to live. And the, there's a five dollar cover charge, and the band goes on stage at nine p.m. Ah, movies this week. We got two movies opening up in the box office this week: A Nightmare on Elm Street, and then Furry Vengeance. So I've never seen any of the Nightmare on Elm Street movies, but they all look really scary. So I'm not sure if I'll be go seeing that. But if you like horror, you should definitely check that out. And then Furry Vengeance with Brendan Fraser and Brooke Shields. That looks really cute for the family, so I think it's a, a safe family movie for everyone to enjoy. That, I think it'll be fun. That's just me. Okay, what else? Oh yeah, shout out time! I'd like to give a shout out to the band Versity. It's a local band and the lead singer is Michael Walker. Hi Micah. And congrats to you guys because they are getting some play from the national radio airwaves. So congrats to them, and you can check them out on the Town Orbiter band page to get all their little bio and some information and check out their music. And if you really like it, you should definitely call your radio and tell them to play it and to give them more uh, more feedback and everything, And because we like them. We like our local bands. 
So uh, that's all I have on my list. There's a lot of cool stuff going on this weekend. So check it all out. Hope you enjoyed uh, this little tidbit. So have a great weekend. I'll see you next time.